On April 6, 2022, police were alerted to a shoplifting incident at Lowe's involving a woman who absconded with $1,000 worth of plants. This highlights the ongoing issue of retail theft and the potential impact on businesses, as well as the importance of security measures to deter such crimes. Upon the officer's arrival, they were met with a female disrupting the peace by standing in the roadway and shouting loudly. Her behavior not only drew attention to the situation, but also hindered efforts to resolve it calmly. By escalating the disturbance with her vocal outbursts, she exacerbated the already tense atmosphere, potentially putting herself and others at risk. Her actions likely made it more challenging for law enforcement to address the situation effectively highlighting the importance of remaining calm and cooperative in such circumstances to ensure a safe and orderly resolution. Here, step out. Step out. Over here. Over here. Over here. Put the cigarette out. No, I'm not. Put the cigarette out. Put the Put your hands behind your back. No, I'm smoking Put your hands behind your back. No, I'm smoking a cigarette. You guys. Put your hands behind your back. May I please smoke? I want to smoke a cigarette. Put your hands behind your back. I want to Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Give me your other hand. That's all you need to do. Yeah, I'm just trying to listen. Despite the officer's attempt to communicate with her, the woman persisted in her disruptive behavior, refusing to engage in dialogue and continuing to scream loudly. Faced with her uncooperative attitude and escalating behavior, the officers made the decision to take her into custody to prevent further disturbance and ensure the safety of both the woman herself and those around her. Please, sir. Other I'm, a, I'm a. I'm a. Other hand. I am. I am a freaking. Listen to me, to tell them, Mom. Mom, you need to tell them that I'm a targeted individual. You need to relax. Fifty-four. I just need one more here. They're following me. Fuck you! They're harassing me. What is going on? Mom, I'm being targeted in some families by a community. Yeah, roll on your knees. Roll on your knees. Roll on your knees. On your knees. Set up. Set up. Set up. We'll talk to her in a minute. We're going to wait for her to get back to the house. Listen, you need it. As the officers tried to apprehend the woman, she actively resisted, speaking loudly and hurling offensive language at them. Her resistance made it challenging for the officers to safely detain her potentially escalating the situation further. Her verbal aggression added to the complexity of the encounter, requiring the officers to employ additional measures to ensure her and their own. Calm down. Calm down. I'm going to prison. You need to tell the truth. I've been telling you, Mom. I've been telling you. Jennifer, please calm down. All right. It fell off the hip. Yeah, I'll have her 15 here. She's yep. resisting here. I didn't resist. I just wanted to smoke a cigarette, sir. That's it. Does your trailer fell off? I don't know. I don't know either. I don't know what the... Because the trailer fell off. Some, I don't know. That's not what this is about. What is it about? We'll talk to you in a minute. Do you have anything else tucked up anywhere? Anything you brought? Anything like that? Okay. All right. We're going to come back over here. Back in there. I don't we'll be right back. Okay, good Listen, job. we'll be back in just a second. Just give us okay. a second. She's going to have it in a car so she can cal calm down. Uh, so what is that I'm hearing? Yeah, I have a trailer right full of plants. Let's see right there. All the way. All the way in, please. All right, what are, you, what are you saying? You're being surveilled? What was that about? I'm just curious. Is that... So for the longest, I've been calling and saying how I'm being stopped. Oh, calling time. us. Okay. Yeah, I then, thought you meant right now. So I was just making sure it's not No, I am. Right. No, I am. Okay. Uh, uh, I, I feel like I'm a part of some freaking... Uh, cr Listen, it's organized crime. I am a targeted individual, and I've been telling you guys that for a long time. Okay. I right, just give it a second. I was just wanting to come back and talk because you mentioned and I was kind of curious what you were talking about. Somebody was following you, but it might have been us. So, Okay. Yeah. Where we're at is this is believed to be all stolen. No. So we're just investigating theft of stuff from Lowe's. No. So we're under the impression yeah, well, this might be. Mine. All right. We're under here oh, about the plants. Right. The plants might be stolen. The plants are mine. Okay. So that's what we're trying to check. They so just give us a minute. She was then transferred to another vehicle. No. <laughs> Come on, please. Can you stop and be for real? You guys know what the f is going on. Cut it out. Why do you? Right. Not we're, we're not there. We're just. Take me. 
Stop. No f***ing check. Mom, what is going on? You said turn around. You did this to me. You did this to me. Relax. You did this to me. Relax. Give yourself a workout even more. Yeah, it's worth it. And you know what? If Jennifer, I'm going to go to jail, Jennifer, relax. they're keeping them. Jennifer, relax. That's my thank you to you, Grandpa. Okay. I'm sorry, Dad. You guys are actually going to f***ing take those plants? They can't pay me what I already have purchased for what they've done and what they did right as I'm f***ing... They're dumb! Oh, hey. Count them up. I bought them. I bought them. Yeah, I got two f***ing receipts. I bought them. Contractor Pat. $10 a piece. Mom, get me an attorney. Keep my paperwork locked up. I'm going to need it for this one. Stupid f***ing plants for the environment. And I get ridiculed, persecuted, raped, thrown out on the streets and thrown on my face. Because I want to smoke a cigarette. I didn't do anything wrong. You haven't even, you just detained me. You won't even tell me. Hi. Hey, Jennifer. Yes. Hey. I'm also strict with St. People East, so I'm handling the whole call. Um, I'm going to ask you some questions, but I have to read your rights first, all right? Okay. All right. You have the right to remain silent. Anything? Do you understand each of these rights I have explained to you? Yes. Having these rights in mind, do you wish to talk to us now? Yes, I do. Okay. What happened today? I went to go and pick up some plants that I paid for. Okay. And it's just it's for two days now. I I initially dealt with Lowe's, went and bought a set of. I don't understand why they're even taking them. Yeah. When did you pay for them? Today. Any specific one. Today. When did you pay for them? Today. Like today. When? Yeah. Today. When? Right when I got. Right before I went and got the trailer. Okay. As the investigation progressed, the officers observed the woman's persistent, aggressive behavior, characterized by continuous loud speech and verbal abuse directed at them. Her actions served to further complicate the situation, causing irritation among the officers. By escalating the tension through her behavior, the woman inadvertently exacerbated the complexity of the encounter, potentially leading to additional challenges in resolving the situation peacefully. Listen, um, these people are whacked. Okay. Um, do you have proof that you paid for them? Yeah, I certainly do. Where is it? I said, uh, well, uh, my mom's credit card statement. Where's mom? In the house. Which credit card did you use? Lowe's. Lowe's? She has a Lowe's credit card? Uh-huh. Okay. Um, why didn't you... Provide them proof when they ask for proof as you were Because it up. two dudes prior to that night, I had purchased the plants late that night. Okay. They, but they said that they escorted me out. Mm -hmm. I don't think so. Okay, yeah. Because okay. apparently you've been there Sunday, earlier today, and then just now for this Yeah, well, well, I was there in a tank top and I had two dudes approach me while, uh, while I was picking plants okay. out. But you said you paid for these? Yeah. How much was it? Uh, well, we get the contractor's bundle and the bullshit and... How much was it? Do you know? Uh, three something. All these plants were 300 bucks? Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, so apparently that's not what happened because I what saw the happened? video. You came in, got a refund earlier today for plants that you didn't pay for, which was given to you on a gift card, and then you came back go and, and then loaded the up. Card okay. My mother. Mom has it? Where's yes. mom? Where's mom? Let me go talk in to her. House. Okay. Hi. Hi. Are you dad? Are sure, you dad? Uh, I said, I can't understand my granddaughter okay. doing that. I had a, okay. a car and everything to pay for. I give her. He's wrong. Okay. I give her my Home Depot card. I give her my uh, Lowe's card to go pick up some shrubs. Do you have your Lowe's card? No, she doesn't. I asked him to please. I, got, I can't. She didn't pay for it. Oh, my God. What in the, what's wrong with these kids today? I don't know. What's your name, sir? Is your trailer this that, one right here? That's my okay. trailer. Okay, that's your daughter? I didn't know she took the trailer. Okay, that's your daughter? Granddaughter. Granddaughter. Damn. I can't, okay. um, I can't believe she's done something like that. I'm not, why would she do that? And I'm why would she take it. the plants? Huh? Why would she take these plants? Was she sent to get them? Hell no, I got the money. 
Okay. She but was she sent to, take, to get the plants? She didn't have to take them damn plants. Is your wife here? No, my wife passed. Oh, who's here? My daughter. Can I talk to her? Mm -hmm. Oh, well, sure, sure you can. Okay. Yeah. Hi, how are oh, you? Good, how uh, are you? Are you her mom? Oh. Yes, unfortunately. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what's going on? I, I'm not real. In the police vehicle, the officers were taken aback by the woman's condition. Despite being in custody, she continued to speak loudly, vehemently claiming her innocence. Her vocal protests and shock added a layer of complexity to the situation, as her insistence on innocence challenged the officer's perception of the events. Nothing. What? I'm serious. Did she Wait a minute. She didn't pay for a damn thing. All that on the trailer, she didn't pay for it. Well, yeah. well, it was explained was we're landscaping here okay. because this is a rental property. Okay. Um, she, we spent three hundred something dollars. I don't know how much it was, but she went and she purchased um, whatever hibiscus and stuff like that. When was that? Uh, what day was that? I don't know. She had yesterday the damn or the day. I, I okay. I'm not she had exactly that sure. okay. She had no business doing it. Daddy, I'm gonna explain. Um. Mm. She didn't want well, the hibiscus, I guess. So she took it back, but she was supposed to buy something else. Okay. But she and had the car. She didn't know. have to. Did she? Did you actually see her originally come here with flowers? Yeah, she purchased our stuff. When today? Uh, what day did that purchase? It was yesterday or Two, the day before. Days. Sunday like, maybe. A couple of days, she went back and got a credit yeah. for them, okay. from what I understand. Okay. That's what they are saying And today. she was supposed to pay for whatever she got, because right. she had money. She says that you gave her a credit card for Lowe's today. Is I that did. true? I, I did. did. Where's that card? They've got I it. I told you, she Jeff. Got I, I told them. Credit it. card or a gift card? Amidst the woman's lack of cooperation, another individual arrived prompting the officer to seek information from him. With concerns mounting over the unfolding incident, the arrival of this man offered a potential avenue for gathering crucial details. The officer's decision to engage with him underscores the importance of obtaining additional perspectives to piece together the full picture of the situation. <laughs> Cover me. Okay. Alrighty, listen, Grandpa, later. listen, I'm not a bot. It's gonna be violated. <laughs> Please. Okay, we're gonna step into my cruiser, please. All right. Can you, you please not take? We have to. What the? F I'm going to prison. God damn hey. it! Been stalking Jen. me. <laughs> Go on the fucking news. Hey. Go call News Channel Eight. They're trying to throw me in prison. Please step out. Because they're wrong. We step out. God. Just. Do you have any pills or anything hidden in here that we haven't searched? I don't take. Down? Pills. I'm asking you. You know it. Okay. All righty. Mom, call okay. this channel eight. Okay. She can call them all day long. Why are you serious? Her. You know, I'm ready to hurt you, mother. You what? I'm ready to go to prison. Okay. That's what you guys want. No, I just don't want you to steal. That's all. all right. I'm being told to do it. By who? The words for organized crime. And if I okay. don't I comply, seat, please, I get threatened. Okay. okay. Wipe off your tears. Take a seat, please. Take a seat, please. Just take a seat. I'm gonna put a seat belt on you, all right? Turn around, face the other way. All righty. I've been telling you, even on the last one, I said, listen, you guys are fucking The arrival of another female providing precise information to the officer was pivotal. Her account filled crucial gaps, allowing the officer to fully comprehend the sequence of events. This additional perspective from a different witness reinforced the accuracy of the investigation. Get him out of my truck! These motherfuckers are after me! Get the fuck out of my truck! You have no fucking right! So what's going on? I wouldn't go back to Lowe's again, number one. Okay, I, I plan on it. Okay. 
Uh, I want to speak to your captain. Well, it's at the jail. I don't have my captain here. Okay. I don't work for the sheriff's office. Excuse me? I don't work for the sheriff's office. I want to talk to somebody over you guys. Okay. Because there's no way this is going unrecognized and there's too many people. I'm going to get too many witnesses, I'm telling you. Are you requesting a sergeant? Sergeant, captain, I don't care. But I'm being released tonight. And, like, nothing ever happened because I paid... And I'm going to prove it Can to you. stop talking for a second while I call a sergeant for you? I am setting up an investigation. This is bullshit. This is this is crazy. Yeah. No more tears for me because now I'm going to start speaking. I'm, and now I'm talking. I want all my police reports written up too and brought with that, with that sergeant because there's a big problem here. They'll meet you there in about five minutes. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, make sure... Afterwards, I need to see a medical professional because I have COVID. You have COVID? Yes! Okay. I'm sick! Throughout the entire process, the female's behavior remained disruptive and confrontational. Her continuous loud screaming and use of offensive language against the officers demonstrated a lack of cooperation and respect for authority. Okay. Once you get to the jail, you can let them know about COVID. They probably isolate you. I don't know what they're Well, you know, I, I don't care. What do you care about? I need to speak with somebody so I can tell my side of the story and somebody reason with me and go, you know, we've but heard about this. we can't resolve today. Oh, but I have to go to jail because of what you guys fucking agree? You guys allowed in our community? I have no idea what you Yeah, you're whatever. About. You know exactly what I'm talking about. What am I talking about? Can you explain it to me? Yeah, organized crime. You guys, this is what makes the money for you guys. What? Yeah. You guys have been throwing me in jail since 2000 and god dang 14. So whose problem is that? I'm, oh my god, I'm telling you. You guys threw me in prison and made me serve 100% of this time that I've already served. And once that happened, you guys knew. And it was broke out. Upon confirming that the female had stolen dollar $1,000 worth of items, the officer proceeded to bring her to the police station for further processing. This step is essential in initiating formal charges, documenting evidence, and conducting interviews. That, that was a big problem. So what you guys do, excuse me, is I ended up going to prison, ended up going to Jacksonville. Yeah, you know what? I think your mom says that you might want to talk to a doctor. Oh my God! Oh, sorry. Uh, see, because she's like, please, you know, I'm agreeing with you. You fucking got... Oh my God. Oh my God! You might be seeing things that aren't happening. No! I'm just telling you what she did. Review the cameras from when I was there the night before or the day before. I was being discriminated against. No, you call people the N-word who are employees. No, I didn't. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my well, I've God. Got different employees saying that they've I don't care. You need to review the cameras. Okay. This, uh, yeah, this was a setup. Okay. All right. I want, I, I want to talk to your sergeant. I'm following complaints all over the place. No, I'm serious. You guys are going. You're throwing me in prison, basically. I'm Why? I'm in prison. You're throwing yourself in prison. If it goes. That's down. fucked up. Remember, I don't know you. I never met you. But I you know, know you. about me. Uh, only this today. I don't know anything else You're about really... you. Do I look like a type that should just be thrown away because you guys made a mistake? There's no type that looks like it should be thrown away. The only people that get quote put away. Fuck it, I'm done. Throw me, oh, throw me a jail. Don't give a fuck. At the station where supervisor is gonna take your complaint. I don't care. I'm not even complaining. Okay, so do you want to talk to him? Or yeah, not? I do. Okay, he'll be there in about five minutes. In the police station. The woman faced charges including grand theft and battery on an officer for resisting arrest. These serious allegations indicate the severity of her actions and the legal consequences she may face for her behavior during the incident. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit the like button, share your thoughts in the comments section, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. To stay updated on our future videos, click on the notification bell icon after subscribing. Thank you for watching and see you in the next video.